What? Hey guys, uh, what's up? Yeah. Look who took hibernation to a new level. What? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a boy or a girl? <laughs> <laughs> It's Lindsay Ray and welcome back to my channel. I've missed you guys. It's been like forever since I've sat down and spoken to you one on one. You might notice something. Oh, uh, I move. You follow me on Twitter and Instagram, you would know that, and especially Snapchat, because literally a Snapchat in my life. Oh, we'll see. It's very. Let me know if you want to see like a room tour, apartment tour when I'm done. But that's not what we're doing today. Today we're going to be doing fall clothes for curvy girls, big boob girls. Um, Y'all feel me, it's a struggle. Everyone is all like, oh my god, layering, fall. And I'm like, oh, no way, it is hot as balls in Los Angeles. But assuming eventually we remember what seasons are like, us two will be running to our outdoor malls in hopes for sweaters and cozy clothes. So today I'm here to give my fellow curvy ladies ideas on how to dress like a cute fall bunny without looking like an idiot. It's fall! No, it's friggin' 90 degrees out. <sighs> first things first, after you grab your basic pumpkin spice latte, you run to the mall or your closet and you get a sweater. When girls with bigger boobs wear sweaters, it either looks like they've A, gained 20 pounds. Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> Look who took hibernation to a new level. What? <laughs> <laughs> or B, got knocked up. Is that a boy or a girl? <laughs> <laughs> Literally, come to the chest and then just hang down from here. So all this room from your boob to your stomach is now covered, making you look like that's your stomach, even though it's not. And then if you're wearing a cardigan or a button-down like flannel or something, the buttons will just like pull at the top where your boobs is because the rest of your body is smaller. Try to avoid sweaters that just kind of like eat your entire body. Try to stick to cardigans where you have the button option to like undo a few buttons at the top or keep the whole thing open and then underneath you can wear a crop top like this or a just like a tight tank top or any kind of tight shirt so people know that you have a body. Don't be shy girl, work. The next thing when I think of fall besides sweaters is like scarves and hats and stuff. The problem with scarves is like really what's trendy right now is like infinity scarves. They just kind of like stack, stack, stack. On your rack, 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 Hey, Hello? Okay. But seriously, you guys, the problem with this is if you have a larger chest, like, you know that it's already, like, coming up to your neck. Like, your neck is already disappearing. Your boobs are slowly eating your entire body. Just imagine if this was, like, a thick wool scarf. If this was wool, this would literally, like, come up to here. And you could say hasta la vista to your neck. And then with the sweater, you just don't have a body. It's like, your neck's gone, your stomach's gone. What's next? Your face? Houdini. Fall is like the new Houdini. He's back in fall form. Taking vengeance on curvy girls. I need to go to sleep. Now the solution is to wear a regular scarf. Just loop around once and like pull down. You can also stay warm by wearing earmuffs or beanies and let your chest take one for the team and be bare. Well, not like totally bare. That's aggressive and this is not a porn. So you've got your scarves, you got your sweaters, and now what are you gonna do with all of them? Layering, duh. Layering usually just kind of means that you're bulking up to stay warm, which is great, but like I said, if you have curves, it could go terribly wrong. Here's my solution. Crop top, tight shirt, whether it's long sleeve or like this, doesn't matter. A high-waisted, warm skirt, unless it's Los Angeles. Wear a cute button down. Now that could be a flannel, a cardigan, or an open sweater. Knee socks, a cute hat, and bang! You successfully have avoided looking like a Yeti. Like this video if you're a fan of Yetis. The combination of these clothes will make you look like you have a body and still keep you warm. Let me know if you want to see more fall videos. Oops. I've got some Halloween stuff coming up which I'm excited about. So make sure you subscribe if you want to check that out. And leave me a comment below letting me know if you have any other tips that can make you still look like you have a body if it's fall. If you have any layering tips, give me your expertise. And maybe we can start a little conversation in the comments and be like, friends. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And it would mean a lot to me. Maybe we can get to a thousand thumbs up. That'd be pretty crazy. Alright guys, that is it. I will see you in my next video. Make sure you subscribe so you know when it gets posted. And I love you. I'll see you later. Bye.